Rice Farm School has always had singing at this time of year. It started with Peg Princey, she put up a big A-frame, and they would go up and down Cedar Street. In 1992, we dedicated this park to my son, Tom Wallace, and the village realized that he loved Christmas. They needed a Christmas tree, the space was open, so a 10-foot tree <laughs> was planted, this white fir. And since 1992, um, with, the, with the church, West Parish, we have celebrated a tree lighting carol sing. It has been traditional. We don't change it very much. We sing the same songs. We come together. The tree has been lit for 20, I figured it's been 24 years. Rain, snow, no matter, beautiful moonlit <laughs> night. We have never canceled this part of the program. And um, it, it's wonderful because some people just come for the village green part. Some people just come for the, the singing and the, and the program in the, the parish house. And some people go to both. Everybody gathers on the green first. This is tradition. We um, have a microphone, you know, as somebody leads the singing, we have a trumpeter who um, plays the trumpet to accompany us. And we are given little uh, flashlights compliments of the Civic Association or the town of Barnstable actually I guess um, that have little lights on them pen lights and so we have music sheets and sing the music from them um, Santa comes from the firehouse well, we have it <laughs> he, book, he books us in and he shows up he shows up and he actually has a very special child or adult I guess that um, plugs in our Christmas tree and it's lighted at that time. Mm -hmm. And uh, then everyone goes into the meeting house and our minister, Reverend Reed Bear, has incorporated actually those folks that have been in the manger scene up in front of the church and he reads the Christmas story from the Bible and it, that is interspersed with Christmas carols that are in our hymnal. We have a special, something special this year. <gasps> Oh, the, the, uh, our bell choir is playing, and that is a big draw for people. They really enjoy that. They really do. Then there are luminaries that lead us up into Jenkins Hall, which is on the other side of that teardrop, and that is where everybody enjoys refreshments.